Magic is creating the illusion that you can defy the laws of nature. This is magic. Magic is creating the illusion that you can defy the laws of nature. Science is the study of how the natural world works. This is science. Sun, 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 here it comes. The sun is very cool. Actually, Steve, it's really, really hot. Hmm, actually, you're right. It's not very cool. It's very, very hot. The surface of the sun can reach more than 10,000 degrees Fahrenheit, 5,500 degrees Celsius. That's about 100 times hotter than most of the hottest places on Earth. Uh. What's really incredible? The center of the sun can reach 27 million degrees Fahrenheit, 15 million degrees Celsius. But I like it. No, I'm pretty sure I love it. It's big, it's beautiful, it's warm. Hey, it's a lot like me. <laughs> Just kidding. But the sun really is pretty doggone amazing. The sun, our sun, is at the center of our entire solar system. <laughs> the Earth, where you and I live, is part of our sun's solar system. In fact, that's what solar means. Did you get that? Everything in our solar system, including the Earth, revolves around the sun. Literally, it all orbits the sun. We are spinning around the sun at approximately 67,000 miles an hour, 107,000 kilometers per hour. How fast is that? If you drove that fast in a 500 mile race, you'd finish in about 26 seconds. Each single orbit or rotation around the sun is one year in Earth time. The sun is a really big deal. And not just because it's the center of our solar system, but also because it makes life on planet Earth possible. The sun is throwing enormous, enormous amounts of light and energy in our direction. And that plays a major role in all life on Earth. First, the sun triggers photosynthesis in plants. And of course, that triggers the CO2 cycle which is essential for all living things on Earth. The sun provides the warmth that living creatures must have to survive. Uh. The sun makes a day at the beach pretty awesome too. The sun's energy can also be converted into electricity for humans to use. The sun is pretty awesome, but can the sun's energy be renewed? Well, no, not really. The sun is an interesting case in the renewable versus non-renewable conversation because the sun is really huge. <laughs> and technically, its energy is non-renewable. It's not being replaced. But the sun is so huge. The use of the sun's energy by humans will not use it up. That's kind of hard to believe, isn't it? that something could be that huge? Imagine that the sun is the size of a basketball. Then that would mean that the earth is the size of this wiffle ball. Nope, this eyeball. Nope. The earth would be the size of this teeny weeny little BB. That's right. If the sun were the size of this basketball, the earth would be the size of this itty bitty little BB. Uh. That means there's a lot of solar energy available to us Earthlings from the sun. A lot. 
I even have a 21 panel solar array in my front yard to capture the sun's energy and to use it in my home and TV studio. Solar energy is the conversion of sunlight into electrical energy that humans can use. Energy that is collected and converted to electricity is called solar energy. Solar panels are pointed at the sun. The sun's rays excite the molecules in these panels. These fast-moving molecules are then transformed into electricity. And that electricity can be used to power all sorts of things. Lights, computers, game systems, TVs, tablets, iPads, iPods, street lights, and dirt bikes. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Did you say that dirt bikes can be powered by electricity? Well, uh, yes, Nelson. As a matter of fact, they can. And the cool thing, they are very quiet and super fast. Oh, lovely. Even cars can be powered by electricity from the sun. That's right. Some cars can be powered by electricity rather than gasoline. Internal combustion engines, gasoline or diesel, always create pollution. Electric cars, however, create no pollution when powered by the sun. <coughs> the sun even provides electrical power for satellites that orbit our planet. Man-made or artificial satellites are constantly orbiting the Earth, sending weather info to us, sending TV signals to us, sending cell phone signals to us. Satellites don't have a really long extension cord plugged into a socket in your kitchen. Yeah. That power is coming from solar power. It's coming from the sun. Another cool thing about solar panels is the systems are expandable. You can put a few panels in and start using solar energy immediately. And then add more panels later or, and this is what I love, you can use small solar collectors to generate small amounts of electricity. This snowman is being powered by the sun. This is a cell phone backup battery. It has been charged by the sun. This very, very bright LED light is being powered by the sun. This very bright street light can be powered by the sun. This is a no pollution, no noise generator. That's right, the power stored in this generator was collected from the sun. This bad boy is powerful too. I can run an edge grinder off this power for hours and hours. It's powerful. Woo. Powerful. Solar energy is really cool, but there are a few drawbacks. First, on cloudy days, most of the sun's light does not reach the ground, so that energy can't be used or harnessed for solar collection. On cloudy days, the amount of energy that I can collect with the solar collectors in my front yard can go from a teeny trickle to almost none almost none at all. At night, when it's dark, the amount of energy you can collect from the sun is... That's right, zero, zip, absolutely none, nada. You can only collect sun energy in the daylight. Solar panels must be directly catching waves of sunlight to make electricity. That's why batteries are required for nighttime electricity use with solar systems. This is not a huge problem because there are some really amazing long lasting batteries these days, but you can't collect any solar power at night. Second, solar energy upkeep and maintenance costs are quite low. But at first, it can be quite expensive to install solar power for an entire home. Buying solar panels, converters, batteries, and paying to have someone install them can cost a lot of money. This is a disadvantage, but the cost for solar energy continues to go down, 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 and down. Third, for big solar projects, a lot of land is needed. If you want to make a lot of sun power, you're going to have to put out a lot of solar panels. There are, of course, a ton of great things about solar energy. Collecting solar power makes no pollution. Using solar power makes no pollution. The supply of solar power is simply inexhaustible. We can't run out. Just because the sun looks tiny up in the sky and you think, how much power can that teeny weeny little thing make? Think back to the last sunburn you got and how quickly that happened to you. The sun is always sending its energy and light to the earth. The sun, our sun, is really amazing. We live in a solar system that revolves around 
our sun. The sun makes plants grow, feeding almost everything on the planet. The sun can dry our clothes. The sun's light can be converted into electricity and used by humans. It can even power your car. The vast majority of energy on Earth comes or originally came from the sun. It's the sun's energy that's being stored in carbon fuels like coal or natural gas. The sun's energy starts up and keeps the water cycle going. The sun makes the rain fall and the wind blow. The sun keeps the earth habitable and warm. Without the sun, the earth would be way too cold to live. Uh Steve, did you know that scientists believe that the sun will last another 1.5 billion to 3 billion years? Indeed, the sun provides the most abundant free source of energy to us humans. That's cool. No, 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 that's hot. The sun is super duper amazing. The world consumes approximately 150,000 terawatts of power each year. The sun produces that in less than a second. Nice job, Mr. Sun. Thanks. It's for free, it can power you and me. Sun juice, it's from the sun, it can power everyone. Sun juice, it's for free, it can power you and me. Sun juice, it's from the sun, it can power everyone. Sun juice, it renews, go power, no excuse. PVs for TVs, it can go key. Electrons like Mighty Mouse are flying around my old house. It's our hope, it's super dope. Solar power, grab that rope. Sun juice, it's for free. It can power you and me. Sun juice, it's from the sun. It can power everyone. Sun juice, it's for free. It can power you and me. Sun juice, it's from the sun. It can power everyone. It's simple biology. Sun power every hour, all day long. The solar shower, doable, renewable. Teslas are very cool. Clean and clean, green machines. Eco powers on the scene. Sun juice, it's for free. It can power you and me. Sun juice, it's from the sun. It can power everyone. Sun juice, it's for free. It can power you and me. Sun juice is from the sun, it can power everyone. Sun juice, sun juice, sun juice, sun. Juice. sun Talking sun juice. We're talking sun juice. 